Hi, this is Gabe Romero with Man Packing. We're here today with Adrian Alvarez, Field Supervisor for Brassicas for Man Packing, and welcome to April's Field Report. So Adrian, tell me a little bit about what Salinas Valley is looking like. In February and March, we had an unusual amount of rain. It wasn't letting us get to the fields on time, and it wasn't letting our farmers do the practices that they needed to do, which was fertilize. So these fields were coming on a little bit later. Now, I think we're back to the point where we're getting the good weather, the fields are moving like we're expecting them to, and our yields have already been showing the signs of the fields going back to normal. Looking out the next 10 days, the rain does look like it's gonna come into the forecast. Give me a little insight on that. Fields are bogged down with too much water. Soggy conditions are gonna make the machines dig down a little bit deeper. And what happens is it starts affecting us with our second and third cuts. So what we're doing is we're forced to kind of play the weight game and go into other cuts where we know we're not gonna be risking the entire field by going into it when it's wet. Well, now, these plants are able to be fed and we're seeing the results in the length and the size and the girth of the plant and these plants are a lot healthier, they're a lot taller and they're producing more shoots. The little water that we get, it's a little bit of a sprinkle, which actually does the opposite effect of getting too much water. It's helping our yields. We're able to go in the fields on time and the cuts that we're in are producing what they normally produce because we have the weather that we're used to having up in the Salinas Valley. So as we end the Salinas season, broccoli and cauliflower and broccolini supplies look to remain steady, although any implicant weather can change at any point in time. Leaf and lettuce, on the other hand, we're looking at lighter weights, lesser yields, as well as possible 30 count lettuce as we move into Salinas. As we finish up the Yuma season, high temps in the high 80s and 90s are bringing about more bug presence. So from Gabe Romero, and Adrian Alvarez of Man Packing. We look forward to the next field report.